What up, YouTube? What up, TTC? Uh, what's good, Dirty Bird Nation? How we doing today? Uh, it is Saturday afternoon. Just checking in with y'all. Um, just want to send a shout out to Mad Mike Sports. I uh, want to send a shout out to Unintentional Grounding, uh, Falcon Eye Day, Aries Falcon, and Neighbors, uh, David in Atlanta, Joe Rock, man. Where you been at, dog? You know what I'm saying? We've been looking out for you, man. I haven't um, seen some videos or, um, you know, we haven't seen you in the hangouts. So uh, come through, man. Hit your boy up, man. Let me know what's good, man. Um, just want to talk about uh, Ricardo Allen um, jumping on this this the requesting more money train. Uh, I guess his contract is up this year, and he wants a contract extension. Um Ricardo, Ricardo, uh, starting free safety, pretty much plays the middle of the field, lines up the secondary, gets everybody in place uh, whenever we're checking in the co different coverages or, um, you know, we, we might run a, a particular zone, uh, you know, if they, they target a certain receiver or if we know they like to do this on second and third down and, and passing downs second and long they have these tendencies third and long they have these tendencies um he's a quarterback of the secondary so um do i think he deserves a contract extension uh no i don't i don't think he does um i'm more of a you know what have you done for me lately i'm more of a um you know show me you know what i'm saying get out and show me that you reserve, uh, you deserve a contract uh, extension before you get out there, and you know what I'm saying. Um, show me in OTAs, show me in training camp, you know, show me in the in the preseason, um, the dress rehearsal, the third game. You know what I'm saying that you deserve that contract extension. Um, you can work some things around, put some incentives in there, put some clauses in there, uh, you know, based on performance, but. I, I need to see more out of Ricardo Allen. I know he had some some dumb penalties last year. Um, you know, we would stop a team on third and long, and he would get a freaking unnecessary roughness penalty. Um, you know, late hit, things like that. Um, you know, that kept the defense on the field, kept drives going. So he made some mental mistakes last year. I mean, nobody's perfect, you know, but. That's one of the things uh, you could put in his face saying, hey, man, uh, look at the tape right here. You know, you didn't have to hit this guy so late. You didn't have to push this guy out of bounds when he's already out of bounds. It's a 15-yard penalty automatic first down uh, because you're being over aggressive. You know what I'm saying? Um, I mean, I, I don't think he gave up, you know, that many deep passes. Um, I just haven't seen him get a lot of interceptions. Um, I know he's a good tackler in the open field, which is, you know, uh, vital to being a free safety, but I just haven't I haven't seen him make any spectacular plays. I haven't seen him get a pick six or you know scoop up a fumble and run it back for a touchdown. You know what I mean? I haven't seen any any um, wild plays from him. So uh, that's the reason why I don't I don't feel like he deserves an extension. Um, I know uh, Matthews is up for a um, contract extension. You know he's up to get some money. Uh, Grady Jarrett is up. You know what I'm saying? To get some money. Um, I don't know who else is going to restructure their uh, their contracts here, uh, you know, later on during the season. But this guy, I don't feel like he deserves it. I feel like he should, he should come out and make some big plays. And let's, let's see after four games, you know, how bad you want to uh, get your extension, how bad you want to get you know, more money from the from the Dirty Birds, you know what I'm saying? Um, so, um, I was listening to Mad Mike and just wanted to, you know, chime in on the video. Um, just chilling right now, uh, running some errands, of course, sitting in traffic. So, just want to check in with y'all. Um, y'all be safe this weekend. Uh, safe travels. Do not drink and drive. Uh, take advantage of Uber. Call a cab. Even if you've just had one drink, you know what I'm saying? Some people are lightweights. Um, some people are on different medications. If they mix it with alcohol, it can have, you know, adverse effects. So do not, do not drink or drive. If you're under the influence, if you're not feeling well, if you're sleepy, that's another thing too. 
uh, people that's traveling a lot, whether you're driving um, or, you know, uh, out there on the roads or if you're flying, taking the train, bus or whatever, if you're sleepy, uh, make sure you get some rest before you start traveling. You don't want, you want to be, you know, aware when you're traveling, you don't want to be out there half asleep and something happened to you or something happened and you don't react in time and you get hurt so um shout out to everybody traveling over the holiday weekend uh come back with another video uh, probably from the arlington cemetery here in a couple days uh, this is ar10 checking out of here y'all take it easy be safe and i'll get up with y'all later peace